flowering and cone-bearing plants. Flowering plants are known as angiosperms. The word means hidden seeds in Greek. The flower is part of the reproduction system of seed-bearing plants. All flowering plants produce seeds. Flowers developed various shapes and colors and scents to attract pollinators such as bees, ants, and hummingbirds. Most garden plants are in the flowering division. The seeds of a flower are fertilized in the ovary. The ovary protects the seed and provides food for the growing plant. Pollen lands on the flower's pistil and grows down into the flower where the sperm contained inside fertilizes the egg inside the ovary. The ovary is the fruit of the plant, such as an apple, or a tomato, or a grape. Cone-bearing plants, known as gymnosperms, which means naked seed in Greek, gymnosperms produce cones that protect the bare seeds. The male cones release the pollen containing sperm that sticks to and then fertilizes the exposed egg on the female cone. In the springtime, um, all that yellow that blows around that gets that lays down on your car is usually pollen from pine trees. Most gymnosperms rely on the wind for pollination. So the pollen that's on your car has been blown there by the wind. There are three divisions of gymnosperms, conifers, cycads, and ginkgo. Most gymnosperms are evergreens. Yes, that means that they stay green year-round, like a pine tree or a spruce tree. Gymnosperms do not have flowers.